the time has finally come for number one USC to take on the San Antonio Bulls. Now the six and one San Antonio Bulls, they come to town after a big time win in Tennessee. So they had to go east to take on the Vols and the handle business out there. The only loss comes at the hands of Notre Dame. That was on the road as well. But this is the toughest stretch for the San Antonio Bulls. They have to take on number one USC. And then as of right now, Wisconsin is number two. And you guessed it, we take them on next week. And then of course, have to travel to the big house to take on Michigan. So there's nothing easy about this schedule. And on top of that, we have changed offensive philosophy. No more direct snap, no more speed options, more of a pro style attack. And this might be the wrong time time to start off that new philosophy versus the number one team in the country as Dudley makes a huge catch and that's going to put the USC Trojans in SAU territory to kick off the ball game. Beautiful pass right there by Larson. Now to give the ball to Spencer and Spencer he's going to go down after a gain of eight. So it's second and two for the 31 yard line. Larson, he has time, takes a shot deep to the end zone, and that ball is going to be thrown out of the end zone, out of the back of the end zone. That pass is going to fall incomplete. So now Larson with time. Now he runs out of time, and down he goes. Sacked on the play by Simpson. And now SAU is going to bring out that pro style offense for the first time this year. First and 10 single back set. They give us the Richard Thompson, picks up the first down, crosses the 35 up to the 40, and finally brought down by a couple. Of USC Trojans at the 43 yard line. Third and 10 from the 43. Now Smith with time. Fires one over the middle. That's going to be batted away. Try to hit Ryan Ross. But now USC will take back over from their own 22 yard line. Looking to pass Larson. Going to find Williams over the middle. Makes the catch for the first time today. Gain of six for the Trojans. From the 28 yard line. They try to do a speed option. But from behind comes Latimer and brings him down for a two yard loss. Now Larson showing that he can use his legs. Breaks a tackle, puts it on the turf, and it looked like SAU was right there, but USC is going to escape with the football. Now Larson looking, throwing this one to left side, going to find Williams, and he's going to have enough to move the chains yet again. So USC is putting together a nice little drive. They can do with the little option pass, and this time he has a man. That's Williams. Williams makes the catch, and he's down the sideline. Touch down USC and just like that they take a early 7 nothing lead so SAU takes over from the out formation down by 7 from on 17 Yolan and Hargrove goes backward gets tackled by Key and he's just as good as John Key on the other side now we're going to take a shot deep we got Chad who makes the catch Chad crosses the 50 inside the 40 going to rumble and bubble and stumble his way inside the 20 and finally gets pushed out of bounds at the 13 yard line. Nice play right there by Chad Johnson. Coming out of the offset eye for a Macy. He did a little corner route. Got, got behind the USC Trojan defense. And now it's going to be first and 10. It gives it to Seth Bryant, who gets away from man. Head to the end zone. Touchdown, SAU. And just like that, the three play drive ends in a touchdown for the SAU Bulls. And now this ball game is all tied up at seven apiece. One and 20 yard line to get the ball to Spencer. Spencer goes nowhere. Again, that's Latimer with another tackle in this one. Second and 10 for the 20 yard line to get the ball right back to Spencer. And this time Bonner is there. And that's only going to be a gain of force. Now it's third and six. Larson, look, he's going to take off and run. He gets hit at the first down marker. But that's going to be enough to move the change in these poor kids that USC can't spell. First and 10. They're going to do a halfback pass and down. He goes, hit on the play by Foster. The ball comes out, but unfortunately, SAU does not recover another chance at a fumble. So right here, they're going to throw the ball to the left side. It's going to be caught by Williams. Unfortunately, he steps out of bounds, has some running room, but it's only going to be a gain of about, I want to say, 10. So now it's third and five from the 35-yard line. Larson over the middle. That's going to be caught by Bruitt, and that's going to be another first down. The ball is on the SAU side of the field. Third and three from the 46. Charlotte Jumbo set for the USC Trojans. Give it to Spencer. Makes a move in the hole. And he has enough to pick up the first down on third down. It's now second and 10 from the 40-yard line. Larson with time. Larson takes a shot deep in the far. Rio, the big tie in. In double coverage. Makes the catch. First and 10 for the USC Trojans. And it really doesn't matter what SAU does on defense right now. USC continues to march up and down the field. Lawson, he's going to use his legs this time. He escapes the pocket. He's going to get down to the one-yard line. First and goal for the USC Trojans. They go to the air on first and goal. They're going to find Rio again. This time in the flat. Gets across the goal line. Touchdown, USC. And now they're up by 7. 14-7, USC on top. 
So SAU takes back over. Get the ball to Richard Thompson. Going to the right side. Go, goes up to the 30-yard line. Picks up the first down move, though. Change for the SAU Bulls. Adrian Smith dropping way back. Takes a shot deep. And Ryan Ross makes the catch. What a throw right there by Adrian Smith. And Ryan Ross holds it in at the two-yard line. The junior receiver has been making plays all season long. First thing go from the two-yard line to give it to Hargrove. Makes a man miss fighting towards the end zone. Touchdown, SAU Bulls. And another three-play drive gets the job done. And we answer the score of USC with a touchdown ourselves. So 14 to 14 is the score. They go with another halfback toss, and John Key is there to shut that down. Third is 16. Larson. He's gonna throw this one to the flat, and that pass gets batted away by right. And we force him to go three and out. Richie Thompson knows to play fake. Smith with Tom has a man open. That's Cole. Marco makes the catch at 35. Gets brought down at about the 30. Move those chains for the SAU Bulls. Beautiful pass right there by the true sophomore quarterback, AJ Smith. And you know Mark Cole's gonna bring that thing in. He has speed, but he also has very, very good hands. Second and ten. Richie Thompson out of the offset out formation. He's gonna pick up the first down again, and that's gonna be another first down for the Bulls. First and 10 from the 18-yard line. Smith, he has time. Rolls to the left side, stops, pops. Gonna find his man, Ryan Ross, in double coverage, and the USC Trojans can't stop this offense because they are playing pretty good coverage, but we are just making plays, showing that we might be more athletic than USC. Aaron Kelly gets in there for the stop, shuts that run play down. Dropping back the pass, gonna find Pruitt, who makes the catch, and he's gonna set up a very manageable third and four. So it's third and fourth for the 24-yard line. Larson with time. Gonna throw this one to the right side. That's gonna be caught on the out route by Williams. But Kenny Williams, he appears to be a little bit shaken up. Look like it's his shoulder or his elbow. Larson dropping back the pass. He has time in the pocket. Throws it to the flat. That's gonna be caught by Spencer. And that's gonna set up a manageable second and three from the 39-yard line. Play action pass. Larson with time. Throws it back across the body. Gonna find Taylor. And Taylor, he makes the catch. And that's gonna be first down number 11 here in the first half for USC to go with the triple option. Larson keeps it himself, makes a man miss and finally gets brought down by Foster but not until he picks up a first down. Larson again going up top but get that thing out of here. Matter of fact it's going to be intercepted by Butler and Butler he tipped it to himself gets the pick. Aaron Kelly appears to be shaking up but what a play by Butler. Gets the ball back for SAU with plenty of time to march down the field. Smith looking. Smith throws this one and that's going to be intercepted set the by Walker the middle linebacker comes up clutch with his second INT of the season and now USC they can actually tie this thing up before the half so not the best pass right there by Adrian Smith but now the defense has it third and 10 for the 25 yard line be an excellent time to get the ball right back and that's exactly what they do that play that pass play is a head scratcher as it only picks up about a yard they need a 10 they got the center for a field goal the kick is up and the kick is good so 21 to 17 is the score SAU is still on top with plenty of time to march downfield and score some more. So Smith, he's going to take a shot deep in double coverage. And Mark Cole comes up with it. Beautiful catch right there. Not the best pass, but Mark Cole just says, throw, it, throw the ball up, dog, and I'm going to go get it like Randy Moss used to do back in the day. Now we're going to take a shot deep to the end zone. Ryan Ross has a step. Ryan Ross has the football. Touchdown, SAU Bulls. And just like that, it is a two-possession game. Ryan Ross goes up top. This kid has some speed. When he came to school, he seemed like he was more of a possession receiver, but he has shown that he has some speed to get downfield. Rio, he's going to make the catch at about the 50-yard line, make that the 48. The ball is placed at SAU's 48-yard line for second and 10. Single back set. No, it's an empty backfield, excuse me. Larson, he's going to take it himself, makes one man miss, cuts up field, and now USC is in field goal range. So USC's going to try a 39-yard attempt. The kick is up. And the kick is good. So USC, they're going to cut it to a one possession lead, 28 to 20. SAU is on top. All, all USC needs is a touchdown and a two-point conversion. This ballgame was all tied up. So to start the second half, SAU gets the football up that gut with Richie Thompson. And he's going to make a big-time game. So now it's second. Now it's first and ten, excuse me. They give it to Thompson again. Gets it to the 40. Picks up the first down. Gets in the USC territory. And finally gets brought down at about the 45-yard line. Now it's second down. Second and now we get the ball to 
Seth Bryant around the outside, picks up the first down, and Clifford, the cornerback on the left side, he's actually going to bring him down by the face mask, so tack on 15. More personal foul face mask, and now we have the ball inside the red zone. Third and 12 from the 19-yard line. Smith with time. Smith takes a shot deep to the end zone, but that's going to be intercepted by Sullivan. Try to hit Ryan Ross for his third touchdown of the game, but unfortunately that pass is intercepted. That's going to be the second turnover by Adrian Smith on the day. So it's second and six from the 24-yard line. They're going to drop back the pass. On second thought, Larson, he's going to take it himself. Gets brought down by Vincent, but not until he picks up a first down, and he is the leading rusher and, of course, the leading passer for the USC Trojans. Third down, Larson with time. Throws it to the left side, and that pass is off the hands of his receiver, and that's going to set up first and 10 for the SAU Bulls. They give it to Richie Thompson from his own 10-yard line. Picks up the first down, trying to get away from a couple of defenders, but gets brought down at about the 26-yard line. Now it's second and 10 to get the ball to Seth Bryant. He gets a nice block. He's going to pick up a first down, and now this ground and pound is working for the SAU Bulls. They just keep on marching up and down the field. They get the ball to Richie Thompson again. Crosses the 50 in the, SAU, in the USC territory, and he's going to pick up another first down. Third and 11, play action pass. Smith looking at Smith, goes down. Couldn't find anybody open and get brought down by Newton. That's his first sack of the ball game. So USC's going to take over. They're going to go with the option. Larson, he has it. Larson, he's going to keep it. He works his way upfield, and he is the one-man show here for USC, trying to tie this ball game up at 28. From the 36, yard on first and 10. Takes a shot over the middle. That's going to be Rio, who makes the catch. Takes a pretty nice hit, but he's going to dust that thing off and try it again on third and three to get the ball to Spencer. Spencer with running room. He cuts up field, picks up the first down on third down, and that's another third down conversion for the USC Trojan. Larson to the left side, gonna find Pruitt. Pruitt makes the man miss. Pruitt's down the sideline and Pruitt's headed to the end zone. Touchdown USC, and they will go for two to try to tie this thing up. So the two point conversion try is here. Larson, he's gonna throw this thing to the right side. That's gonna be batted away. I believe that was right or Schultz on the coverage. And the lead is still in SAU's possession. Only up by two now, but down goes Adrian Smith. The ball is loose and USC recovers. And that is exactly what USC needed. Only down by two there. Definitely going to take the lead on this drive unless SAU can get a turnover. Larson's going to take it himself. Takes a big hit by Bonner, but he hangs on to the football. That's Bonner's fourth tackle of the ball game. Second and four from the four yard line. They can tell he still pick up a first down. Larson with Tom has all day. Throws it back across the body, and that's going to be incomplete. So now it's third and four. Single back says the fullback is left in the backfield again. Go to Spencer, who went in motion out of the backfield. Makes the catch. Picks up another touchdown. And now USC is only down by six. They went for two again, but they did not get it. Now Ryan Ross on the kick return. Gets up to the 30. Makes the man miss at the 40 and finally gets brought down with a beautiful kick return. That's going to set us up a beautiful field position. Give it to Hargrove. Makes the man miss. And now, just like that, we are in USC territory. First and 10 from the 45 yard line. Give it to Hargrove. Hargrove in the room. Gets up to the 25 yard line and finally gets brought down in about the 22 big time game by the big time back. Third and 11. Smith going over the middle. Going to find Hargrove out of the backfield who makes the catch on third and 11. Move those chains for the Bulls. Richie Thompson headed to the end zone. Touchdown. SAU and number five has taken the lead versus number one in the country. 35 to 32. A three point lead for the SAU Bulls. Now it's time to see what this defense can do versus Larson in this USC offense. Larson's going to take off again. Bonner is there to bring him down, but he brings him down by the face mask. So tackle on 15 at the end of that run. Second and 10. Larson with time. Over the middle. That is caught. I thought it was batted away, but that's going to be caught by Taylor, and that's going to be another first down for USC. On first and 10. Larson looking. Takes a shot deep in the double coverage, and Foster is there to bat that thing away. And now it's third and 10. Larson drops back the pass. Has all day. Rolls to the left side. Throws back across body. That's going to be intercepted by right. Right. Crosses the 50 in the USC territory. Crosses the 40. Inside the 20 10 5 touchdown. SAU Bulls as he high steps his way to the end zone. And the USC fans don't like that, but right, he got swag and he took that thing to the crib. 
crib and he wanted to let everybody know that he is prime time junior i guess in his estimation anyway spencer after the back gets brought down by right and that forces a three and out. So now agent smith with a chance to put this game on ice but that pass gets batted away and now we go three and out. so usc they take the ball right back over down by 10 to give it to spencer with a minute 22 to go he gets away from the free safety vincent and picks up a nice chunk of yards First and 10 to go right back to the ground game. This is not the best solution when you're trying to score quickly, but as long as they march down the field, I guess the USC faithful won't have a problem with this. Second and five from the 42 yard line single back set. They go back to the ground, but this time Aaron Kelly is there to bring him down. That's his fourth tackle of the ball game. Larson with time. Larson gets away from one man, gets away from another, makes Vincent miss, breaks a tackle, breaks another, gets away from another man. He's finally inside the red zone. What a play right there by Larson. Looking like Mike Vick from back in the day. Larson rolling on out. This time he does go down. Latimer gets his second sack of the ball game. Second and 14. Now they give it to Spencer. Makes a man miss. Finally gets brought down by, I believe, Foster. And that's going to set up third and four. From, from the 11-yard line, and they're going to pick up the first down. So move those chains for the USC Trojans. They head right back to the line of scrimmage. First and goal from the eight. They give the ball to Spencer with 15 seconds to go. And again, the clock management has been horrible for USC. Four seconds to go. Do they go back to the ground? No, it's a play fake on to the air. That's going to be caught by Taylor. And you know what? If they would have took those two PATs instead of going for two, they could go for two right now and tie the ball game up. But unfortunately, they have to settle for the PAT and still be down by three. Onside kick with a second left. Hargrove, he recovers it. And that is going to do it. SAU beats number one USC. And now it is going to be interesting to see where the Bulls will be ranked. Will it be number one? Will it be number two? Will, will, will they even be in the top three? Only time with 12, only time with, only time with tell, excuse me. But that is going to end this fantastic ball game. Again, SAU beats USC 42 to 39. And now we have to take on Wisconsin, who is number two as of right now. But if they lose, they will definitely not be number two anymore. Adrian Smith only completed nine of his passes, but 288 yards, had two TDs. But he also did have two turnovers, two interceptions. That's not good. But for the rest of the offense, we played pretty well, it seems like no matter what type of offense we do we will be able to run the football because hey this is running back you but that's gonna wrap this one up i hope you guys enjoyed the video as always i enjoyed bringing it to you i hope that the rest of the day is the best of your day and i'm gonna see y'all later peace Hot sauce.